Good morning, friends. My name is Jason Sisk Provencio, and I'm the pastor at the United Church of Christ Congregational of San Luis Obispo on Los Osos Valley Road, and I'm here with a peace nugget this morning. I hope that everyone had a good night's rest last night, that everyone got some good sleep. I actually wanted to talk about sleep this morning because it feels like the coronavirus pandemic has impacted every aspect of life, including sleep. If you're like me, you have... Hi, Sammy. Good morning. If you're like me, you have not been sleeping the way that you normally do. And uh, you find yourself waking up several times throughout the night and uh, it's hard to sleep uh, a really deep, really uh, regular night's rest right now. And I just wanted to hear what is working for you all. What is helping you sleep right now? What's helping you get a good night's sleep? I will tell you one thing that did not help me go back to sleep. And that is uh, turning to my phone and just casually checking out the news. Uh, that's not a good strategy right now. That just uh, got my heart pumping even faster and it made it even harder to sleep. And likewise, uh, Facebook is probably not a good thing to start checking at 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning whenever you wake up. Um, actually, smartphones in general, are not good things to look at in the middle of the night because the lights activate our brain and it makes us think that it's time to get up and get going. So uh, I've learned that lesson. I have started listening more to Audible, to books on Audible. I downloaded um, a couple of books by Dallas Willard, who uh, was a contemporary American philosopher and theologian, and I find that just not trying to focus on anything visually, but just listening to something, listening to someone read, uh, has been soothing, comforting. But I know other people wake up um, and they pray, and that helps them fall back to sleep. Um, other people meditate, and they practice breathing uh, exercises to help them relax and to sleep. And I just wanted to hear from you all what is helping you get rest right now. Um, or maybe what is not helping you, like me checking the news and checking Facebook. Not a good strategy. But what is helping all of you sleep right now? What's helping you get some deep, restful sleep? Uh, I think we can all learn from each other in so many ways right now. So share your best practices. Friends, I hope you have a wonderful day today. I hope that you are staying safe and healthy, that you're calling friends and family members and checking the people in your life and helping in any way that you can help right now. This is a good time to reach out to people. So. Everyone stay safe, have a great day, and I will see you tonight at 8 o'clock for a nighttime nugget. And you might see my new haircut. It's getting awful long. Um, there are two people capable of cutting hair in our household. That's me and Steven. We'll see which one of us gets to the clippers first. All right, friends, have a great day. See you tonight. Bye-bye.